the long-awaited high-level diplomatic meeting between Somalia and Kenya has finally taken place. Nairobi sent Foreign Minister Rachel Amamo to Mogadishu. She met with Prime Minister Mohamed Roble on Sunday. A statement from the PM's office indicated the two officials talked about strengthening diplomatic relations. Before she met with Roble, Kenya's top diplomat sat with President Formaggio. Omamo also met with the Somali Foreign Minister, Mohamed Abderizak, after which a joint communique was issued. The ministers also reiterated the importance of regional stability and committed to work together with other colleagues in the region and the international community to promote peace and security. Tensions started toward the end of last year when the government of President Mohamed Formaggio accused Kenya of interfering in its internal affairs. Nairobi has long had a strong relationship with Jubaland leader Ahmed Madobe, a Formaggio rival. Kenya Defense Force troops under the African Union peacekeeping mandate are based in that state. Then there is the maritime dispute, which came before the International Court of Justice, or ICJ, this year. Somalia appears confident of a favorable verdict, while Kenya has issued a fresh call for mediation. The Roble Omamo meeting did not result in a change of Mogadishu's position of abiding the court ruling. Nairobi has been unhappy that shipments of the mild stimulant Khat have been suspended since early last year. It is a multi-million dollar business for Kenyan farmers. Somalia initially stopped the trade because of the coronavirus. Addis Ababa resumed their shipments and the two countries even agreed to a deal in June to trade Somali fish for Ethiopian Khat. Kenya canceled flights between Somalia in May, many analysts saying the one-product trade dispute was the reason. Finally, there was a KDF airstrike that killed and injured several civilians not affiliated with Al-Shabaab. While no major announcement came out of the Somali Prime Minister's meeting, both sides being able to present their positions means that progress can be made. The Kenyan foreign minister presented Roble with an invitation from President Uhuru Kenyatta to come to Nairobi. The two missed a chance to meet when they were both in London last week, where Kenyatta was co-hosting a global education conference with UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson. ADN TV will continue to report on political and diplomatic developments in the Horn of Africa.